And then um, from there, you still have to wait for them to dry. Or you could use like a blow dryer or something. But you don't want like rust. Like, you don't want rust like getting on here. And also, you can get like a needle and start on the screwing in part. You just get a needle and then just like get like spin it around to get all the dirt out which there was a lot of it so yeah you still have to clean it just you can use your fingernail too like that and it cleans out like mostly everything and yeah you just keep on doing now you don't really have to clean the center caps like there's no reason to clean them but um if you really really want to clean them then i guess i'll show you how it's not that big of a deal but okay you just get your center cap and your wet towel and just rub the edges on it like that there's no real point in doing this except the fact that it might get some some stuff off but that's about it okay and as promised the lubrication part um, well first of all we need well I'm doing it the spreadsheet way it takes um, it takes more time than just opening up your ruby sheet and just going and spraying it in but I think it's more effective this way so you get your lubrication you make sure it's very well shaken and you want your pieces to where all like the holes are all facing the same way I just picked this piece up and if you turn it this way the hole see how there's like a little hole there for your edge piece I want it to be like that it doesn't really matter if it's facing this way but you just want it to face the same way so you know which pieces have been lubricated on what side and you just want to like aim it straight down like this and just spray it from here so huh, are you supposed to shake this? yeah you're supposed to shake it but uh, it doesn't matter if you use silicone and this is just a silicone spray on so. and then you just turn it And you do it again. And turn the pieces. And you're done for there. And um you can just switch out the pieces. So and I'm just gonna go ahead and move these. And you want to order like the edge pieces in the same way you did before. So, or not really. Like the holes at the top right now, turn it to the left or right. It doesn't really matter, but holes at the top, turn it left. Holes at the top, turn it left. And you just keep on repeating a pattern over and over again. Like solving a cube. Second algorithm, if you want to see it that way. Yeah. And then you do the exact same thing that you did with the other ones. Turn it, all the pieces. Like that. You don't want to spray too much on it. Oh god, I messed up. Uh, and if you just mess up, just bring it like somewhere else. And that's it.
Uh, well, if you want to, you can do the uh, centerpieces. But I don't really see a reason why. Well, actually, no, I do. I do not. I think about it. And you can go ahead and just wait for it to dry or not. If you're going to do the centerpieces, have them all just facing up. And do the exact same thing. Wait. And you want a space between them, of course. And that should be it. Now you can do, if you have silicone, and it's different. You, 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 you spray on it, you wait 10 minutes, you turn it. You spray on it again, you wait 10 minutes, and you turn it. Well, you can do that, but that's not really. So the first step is to just completely like put all the pieces on except for one piece at the top. And then you put the whole cube together except except for the center piece. And I'll just show you what I mean by that. Okay, now that you have every single piece except for the center piece and your cube looks like a void cube. Okay. You go ahead and get your last center piece. Hmm. Put the screws, washers, and springs inside of it. Uh, you have to be careful here. And turn it two and a half times. So one, two, and a half. And then with the rest of the sides, you unscrew them completely. Just so there, I've unscrewed that. And you do it two and a half times. One, two and a half. Oh yeah. And when you're screwing these in, you want it to where it'll it'll make a little cross, like like one side screw here, one side screw there, and there. Um, I don't, I don't know if you can really, like, uh, oh, well, 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 I'll, I'll, I'll just show you what I mean later, but you keep on turning it, you, you, like this side, you unscrew it, all the way, turn it two and a half times, one, two and a half, do it again, and a half and you just keep on doing this on all the sides one two and a half If you feel like it's too loose, then oh, yeah, that, that. if it's too loose, then you keep on turning it half of one. So that's half. Half. Oh god. And you just you just keep on thinking. And if you think it will pop out too easy like that, then uh, you turn it in another half. Uh, 